we're chasing everything British today, and I mean chasing because it's a race here today. Um, we are, are so excited because we have Amanda Gordon from Life at Clover Hill with us. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. You're doing a, a really, a truly British thing. <laughs> this is truly, I had never, yeah. before the weddings and polo mat, I had never heard of these. Tell yes. us about this. So we're making DIY fascinators and everything that I used to make them, you can get at the dollar store here in town. And you oh, can uh, just love it. and put it together quickly and it's fun. And my daughter, is a, she's two, and she oh. thinks they're the funnest dress up stuff. So yes. I'm gonna keep yes. those for her. Oh, I yes. love those. Yes. 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 So um, first of all, let's look at the finished product that's sure. right here. I'm just gonna actually turn this one around so, so that you can really see. This it. one is done with white fake peonies and tulle, and it'd be really fun for even like a bridal shower or something like that. Mm -hmm. And then this one was done with black feathers and a just, just, little just, dollar just, store just. brooch. And that would even be fun for like a 1920s, 1930s oh, party perfect. if you were a flapper. Wouldn't it? And then I, mine was a little yes. ranunculus or one of my favorite flowers. And mm -hmm. so I did a ranunculus. Yes. One well, well, isn't that ranunculus in here? <laughs> so um, I'm going to actually put mine on. Do you mind? Yeah, no, go right on? ahead. That I'm calling a, it mine because... I mean, that's exquisite. It really is, without question. Um, okay, so now tell us the different okay. things that you may need. So sure. uh, right here, let's start at this end. So those are all faux flowers. Um, so I did peonies, ranunculus, some little purple flowers. Mm -hmm. And then you'll need felt, which would be the base of your mm -hmm. part where you're actually going to put the flowers mm -hmm. on. Mm -hmm. This tool is if you want to have some of that kind of tool look. Like, like on the, the white bright, one like there, the that's one. fabulous, yep. yeah. Different colors of feathers. Mm -hmm. I loved mm -hmm. these ones with the gold on it. I thought those were so fun. I'm going to use those. Mm -hmm. And then really easy dollar store headbands. Beautiful. Dollar store brooches. There's some really cute stuff out there. Lovely. And then these are just the ovals that I cut with the So felt. these are really important because you do need them to keep it in place, I yeah. guess. So all it is is an oval cut out of the felt of whatever okay. color you want. And then you cut two slits about an, an inch or so in for or two inches in from the sides. Mm -hmm. And that's where you're going to actually thread mm -hmm. the okay. headband through. OK, so give us instructions and we'll sure. start putting it together. So you're going to want the widest part of the headband or the sorry, the oval to be the part that's tucked inside your headband. So feed it okay. through. Am I doing hole. it like that? Perfect. Yeah, you're yeah, right on. Yes, sorry. and Good actually, job. yours looks yours. You're, you can really tell yours is. Okay. So you can adjust it where you want. You can have it far, like lower down on the side. You could have yeah. it a bit higher up. I see. And then okay. so you have to choose your spot because once it's it chosen, it's then in, that's it's in. it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then you're gonna pull it back a little bit and put a little doll 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 dot of uh, hot glue, glue on. on there and that will just help it stay in place. And do you think uh, for safety reasons do you, this is um, you know how they they sell those little glue dots? Yeah. For like little kids. Yep. I guess you could you do could this, do this with, with white glue too if you were doing it okay. for kids. Because they don't have to last a long I mean. No. They all, all they have to do is go through one morning of the royal wedding. Right. <laughs> which, okay, so. which starts at four in the morning. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> all you diehards. Um, okay, and then what? how do we build from So you here? can add whatever kind of embellishments you like. So if you wanted to go with feathers, you can add the feathers on and carefully glue them on and then cut off wherever the okay. bottom comes off. <laughs> yeah, yes, you can and pull. be careful you don't burn yourself. I know, you can pull I... the strings, the hot glue, off very easily or cut them either. Yeah, and I was... If you wanted to try flowers, you could just pull the flowers off of the stem. Okay. And then just make sure however the flower is attached to its stem, just give a little bit of glue there when you pull it off so that it doesn't all come apart. Okay, I better okay. just get the flower on. And uh, you choose the head pant uh, depending on hair color or... Yeah, you can do based on hair color or the okay. color of whatever flowers or feathers you're putting in. So if you have dark oh. hair and you don't want your dark hair the headband to be shown in your dark hair, pick a darker headband. Yours is way better than mine. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what. So tell us what's going on at Life at Clover Hill right now. Sure. So we are getting ready for our third growing season for our Clover Hill flowers business, which is where we grow specialty cut flowers and sell them here in Georgina. And so starting this weekend, we're going to be having our seedling collections, which are seedlings of the cut flowers that we sell. But you can buy some seedlings oh. yourself and put them in your own garden and grow specially cut flowers for yourself 
all summer. So they're going to be at the Clearwater Farms is having a new Friday social, Friday evenings oh, throughout the summer neat. from that's 3 to neat. 7. Okay, I've completely. Yeah, so we're going to be there this Friday, and then we're also going to be at the opening of the Georgina Farmer's Market at the Link in Sutton this weekend, and uh, it's the opening weekend for that as well. And uh, is that a, it's not the entire weekend, is it? Is it just uh, Saturday or just, is it Saturday sorry, Sunday. Sunday? Just Sunday. Sunday, just Sunday mornings Sunday. at the farmer's market. Wow. Oh, that's, and you know what? What a great weekend to, to open, yeah. right? And to get out and, and get some, some local products and see some of the local vendors. And right. I'll be there next weekend. I'm not there because I'm doing the high tea this weekend, That's but right. the Georgina Art Center and Gallery. Well, we'll be we'll there be next the next weekend as well, next so weekend is seedlings. Okay, Super. so you only do a few weekends? Is that how it... Just of the seedlings, yeah. Because oh, then the seedlings, We have yes. 7,000 seedlings coming in that we're planting, and so some of those we keep aside to sell for people who want to put them in their own garden, but the rest go in our field, so we got to get cracking on getting all those okay. flowers and, out to the field. And then I guess it, it's all a, a process for you because then um, when, once you have your seedlings and you're growing your flower, you also do dried in the, don't you do dried uh, stuff as well in the We do dried in the, in the fall. fall. Yeah. yeah. But once we get going, flower season is really, really busy from about July to September. Okay. And then I got to slow down because we're having another baby in October. I was going <laughs> so, to. Such exciting news. Yeah. Thank so, you. I wanted to ask you, but I'm always so afraid. No, I didn't eat too many of those tea cakes what? earlier. I just. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, yeah, we're having our second in October. So that's just, very exciting. Just in time to finish up with the flowers. To, oh, that's yeah. wonderful. Congratulations. Thank you. A little, that's a little so Halloween baby. exciting. Yeah. Um, and. Uh, Tell us about your, I want everybody to hear about your blog too, because we talk about this every once in a while when you're on, but there's so many things happening. <laughs> so This is so pathetic. It's, no, I it's love good. this. I it's love good. the feather. It's good. I, I, think, I think you need to put this brooch yeah, on yeah. yours. I'm going to do that so for sure. So my, my blog is Life at Clover Hill. I've been doing yes. it for eight years. And so I share renovating our farmhouse here in Georgina. Mm -hmm. I also share craft projects like this and recipes and kind of whatever is going on with our family. It's oh, and the beautiful. last time you were on, I, I made a really sad, pathetic Christmas decoration, I think. Weren't we making wreaths? Wasn't that? I don't know. I think I just, I I just reviewed it, and I time. just thought it was uh, very sad when yes. I looked at mine. Yeah, yeah, yours was fun. I hope you have fun when I come in, oh, though. I, I do. Get crafty. Because I'm it. just so not a craft person. Oh, I love this with like, this. Isn't that something? Can you believe that's from the dollar store? I can't believe. That looks like it's something out of out of your mother's or grandmother's jewelry yeah. box, yes. doesn't it? And what you did to, oh gosh, I should have showed the back. You had taken the pin off the back. Yes, so the back of the brooch, oh. just so it doesn't poke you in the head, I had just, using pliers, just pried it off. It came off really easily. And then you can just hot glue it right on. And I'm going to I'm gonna throw a couple of these flowers on as well. Oh, That's the gosh. fun thing is you can add in whatever you like. If, if you could get, you could even get longer tool if you wanted to do it where it kind of came over your yes, face. Yes, because I, I brought some Oops. in for the high tea that have the little... Like I know a little there's a face prop, veil. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah. a proper name mm -hmm. for it. I don't know. They're I mean, some of the ones you see in the UK, yes. they're huge. They're, they're huge. huge. Yes. They're like And they've actually nests. got hats. Oh, yes, yeah. and birds' yes. nests. Yes. And yeah. I have little hats. Yes, and you that, have hats, that, yeah, right? That yeah, that flip to Are you hair. going to be up celebrating the, uh, the wedding? Well, I'm usually up early <laughs> with a toddler anyways. May as well It starts at wedding. four. Maybe not that early. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, oops, dear, not looking. Yeah, all I of didn't. the all of the proceedings start at four. Perhaps. Yeah, when William as they and, go to the when William and Kate got married, I got up and I made scones that morning and just watched the recap. And I was yeah, <laughs> I was I happy went, to do that. I went to a kitchen party in Nova Scotia. I was there on business, so I just went into the kitchen. It was all done. Oh, lovely. I love that. Oh, that's so cute okay. with the with the purple. A little flower. bit of flowers. Look at here's mine. Okay. I, I mean, I love fresh flowers because we grow fresh flowers, but sometimes faux yeah. ones work great. Well, well, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you for having us. me. Stay with us. I believe we're going to maybe drink some tea, taste some chocolate, have a scone or two, all of this and more on Georgina Life.